Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the vlog. Today we have got a fun one on the agenda. I am here with Nancy. She's uh, grabbing some pictures of this place. We just stopped off at Jones Coffee Roasters here in Pasadena, California. To kick off our day, today we are heading to the Vegan Street Fair. There is going to be almost two hundred vendors at the vegan street fair we're gonna meet up with our friends kevin and jessica if you guys have seen uh the wine tasting that we went to if you guys saw the cruise of jericho video when we were at the bahamas we've hung out with them a few times over the past couple months and i'm really excited we've kind of been waiting what a good month like a good month and a half or so nancy's been doing a lot of uh plant-based diet as of how many how many months has it been now I've eaten meat like three months. It's been about three months that she hasn't eaten meat. It's it's just a personal choice. It has nothing to do with oh save the animals, which animals are lovely. Let's save the animals. Yeah. I feel like this is gonna be grub food, like food porn, like oh, crazy yeah. concoctions and like. It's like, like here being vegan, you can still eat this magical shit. Yeah, but it's all just gonna be like vegan. It's a it's the vegan street fair. So I'm excited to see what that it's is. It's nice that I get to walk around everywhere and I don't have to think. Oh man, wait. Can I eat that? That's kind of been the challenge as of recently, especially going to restaurants. So it's going to be really cool. They got a nice little beer garden. They got vegan food, 200 vendors, three DJs, whole bunch of shops, local businesses, which is what's exciting. We get to see all of the local businesses and hopefully we can make some friends and find some locations that are in the area. Officially here, we got Kevin and Jessica with us. We are walking up to the Vegan Street Fair right now. We ended up having a hotel mix-up uh, where <laughs> the hotel that we originally found. Uh, prostitutes. Yeah, we showed up and uh, the North Hollywood Police Department was all over the place arresting people. Uh, so it's some shady looking individuals. Right there is where we're going and it's gonna go all the way down the street, way down there. We are so excited. I think first we're gonna go to the Federal, which is a bar. Man, I'm excited, let's do it. All right, so round one, Philly cheesesteak we got here. A vegan, impossible Philly cheesesteak. I mean, it looks pretty good. It, it looks, I would probably give it a solid like seven out of 10. That was 20 bucks, by the way. $20. <laughs> I hope it was $20 worth. Is, is it $20 worth of good? I mean. It needs more cheese. It's really dry. Uh-oh. I got mustard. They had the, yeah, they had an option for mustard. I felt like it needed, something other than just mustard. Nice passing, nice passing. I, the meat's yeah, believable right? though. Like it actually tastes like meat. Okay. Mm. The I meat's good. The meat is amazing. Um, yeah, it's good. Just coming to a Philly cheesesteak in general, I'm gonna want more cheese. Way more, more cheese, yeah. More, yeah. like I guess maybe when it's- Oozy. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Where the bread's like, kinda gooey. Enough where it soaks in, yeah. into yeah. The, the bread. The bread is kinda dry, like it should be mm -hmm. like- um, Which is probably- Squishy the, and like- Which is probably yeah. the problem because you're not getting the grease. From the real meat. From the actual mm. meat. That's that right. Soaks so into what they it do is it and it makes the bread like they all like. dip it in something that gives it up. Those are the things vegan, we have to vegan, remember vegan because we're doing. Yeah, we're doing <laughs> we're doing vegan, so the, those different uh, variations of things are different. It's really good. Though, it's really good. Yeah. It is really good. It's good, but it, like that it. should be like five bucks. No, not not, not 20. 20. 20. Not 20. 20. 20. 100%. Have you guys had pupusa? I love pupusa. She got yes. really excited. Yeah. I have no idea. Can I tell them? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Look at these pupusas. That looks really good. I mean, interesting. Yeah. Can we take a bite? Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. Is this hot sauce? That was him with that. Oh, that's for the pupusas. Oh. Good? <laughs> Five stars. Oh, wow. Without the sauce? I'll even? be the judge of that. 
Hey, baby, there's a slaw. He loves slaw. Oh, yeah. It's like real food. Mm -hmm. Really? It's good, good? That slaw is weird. It's really good. Is it yeah. great? What is that? Not good. What flavor am I tasting? I mean, it's not gross. It just tastes almost like nothing. The pupusa is damn good. This mm -hmm. is bomb. All right. I like the cheesesteak better. Are these? Mm -hmm. You like the cheesesteak yeah. really? better than this? Mm -hmm. Wow. Mild Vegan oh, really? loaded french fries. I, like it I really like this cookie. I don't know why I love it so much. I mean, why wouldn't awesome. you? I mean, it feels okay, really Okay, so bad. this is a sore. Soy Rizzo, right? Soy Rizzo. Mmm. I tried that before. Soy Rizzo is always like good. Chorizo. Okay. I got a bunch of meat eating friends who buy this actually for their eggs. Oh, uh, really? With yeah. a vegan cheese. It's like nice and spicy. It comes in a tube. It's okay. not that spicy. Not super spicy. It's got a lot of flavor spicy. to it. A ton of flavor. Yeah. The fries themselves aren't that great, but the yeah. whole thing is good. Definitely. My favorite thing is cheese yep. steak. I, I think the fries could definitely be an upgrade. These seem like kind of pre made. I'm oh, really? Judging I'm ready for the mac and cheese. We're going to oh, stop yeah. by there. Oh, yeah. I'm ready for a damn beer. Mac and cheese is going to be bomb. Beer time. Anyway, so the cheese steak was the best. It's bomb. For real. It really is the best thing on the table. About. Oh my god, I'm shaking it. Oh. Shake what your cookie gave you. All right, Kevin's going to try. <laughs> how, how, how do you what do? What are you going to do? Should I just break it? You just bite into it or what? I feel like that's offensive I mean, to the cookie. Crack it. I'm just going to give my a little the death strike. I don't think that's going to work. Way too hard. <laughs> oh, no. All right, what so, have I done? So it, it says it was glass. That, that, it's all obviously got to be candy glass. Nope. That was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's berry flavored. That's awesome. It's like blueberry. Wow, look at this thing. Mm. Yeah. It just tastes like straight sugar. Okay. Which is okay. Uh, no, the no, but cookie it's doesn't. It tastes like Jolly Rancher. Blueberry. The cookie yeah. and the inside doesn't match the 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 the, the ice. presentation of it all. Well, the glass is so strong tasting, and the cookie's kind of like bland. Uh huh. All right, Kelly's croutons here. You're welcome. I mean, it looks like a standard crouton. Um, they're just raw cashews, nutritional yeast, and some spices. Okay. Wow. There we go. We got a sample oh, for you. Yes. yes, that's for like vegetables, pastas, popcorn, anything you use cheese on. It's all wow. made of nuts. Yeah. Sorry, I just like smacked you a bunch of Nutty but cheesy all but at the same time. I was gonna say there's a lot of cheese hints. Yes. Yeah, that's really good. Smoky chipotle. Smoky chipotle. Good. Whoa. It's really good. Huh? Very. It tastes cheesy somehow. This is what you just tried. Okay. We do have all these different flavors, but I'm gonna have you try this. What these are. I love your bananas. These are the crumbs at the bottom of the bags of the croutons. Oh. oh. Mac and cheese, baked okay. potato. All right. It's called just crumbs. That is the bottom. Wow. Good. Man. Yeah. This is really good. And you can taste the bacon. You can taste the crouton. You can taste the like everything. That's nice. I want to go home with that. Yeah. Yeah. So oh here are yes. For people, and if you want to try oh, them. No. Oh no! Okay. I lost it. Thank you. Yeah. Review. Oh really? Uh, no. no. I'm not sure. Oh. I want to try all the flavors. Oh, we've got three people kind of going. Mm. I'm gonna try it out. I think I it's nasty. Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not a vegan anymore, man. You're a murderer. <laughs> You're over here snorting bugs. It really does taste like mushrooms. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's flavored it's like jerky. It, that's weird. I'm not eating that. Like, it's spicy, actually. It, it, like it the did. Flavor. The flavor yeah, was the great. The texture great. was too strange my, my for me to get telling me like it's not food. Like it's like, mushrooms. no, it's not food. Don't really, food really it's weird. Yeah. Hot sauce. <laughs> Sweetie. <laughs> That's pretty hot. Fine. Habanero sauce. Give oh, me a little bit. No. Was the habanero too hot for you? Oh, I'm being a pussy right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're about to go on a little hot sauce adventure right here. Jalapeno. Tangy like the Louisiana style. Ooh. You guys want to try it? So the hot wings, Bloody Marys, micheladas, spicy garlic edamame. That's tasty, full of flavor. Yeah. Yeah, that's really good. And this is our savory dry rub. Do you care to get the back of your hand? Six out of ten. I put this on my avocado toast this morning. 
morning. Oh, Need that safety wow, that's just great. Thank you. That is incredibly good. Okay. Can I try the habanero? Yes, please. Oh, his favorite. He loves the habanero. <laughs> <laughs> I roll my eyes as I say that. Yeah. <laughs> so that one's less tangy than the first one. A lot more layers of flavor, and okay. then the kind of creeps up at the end. Okay. Yeah. You need some chip chasers? A couple chips, yeah. That was my three out of ten. I'll take a couple chips. I'm actually getting a little pepper high from it. Okay, it definitely does have that uh, initial habanero kick, but the flavor is so good in it. This I feel like you can put on everything, like a breakfast burrito, a taco. If you're looking for something with a kick, their habanero hot sauce was really, really good. Really, really good. Do you like this? Do you want to try the habanero? Straight to it. Habanero flavor, and that's from a certified hot sauce judge. It tastes like habanero pepper, but it's not painful. That's nice. No, I like, yes. like really spicy as initial hot and it kind of builds up a little bit. But the flavor is the so good really on great. it that it's enjoyable. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, makes, it makes the hot worth it. Yeah, no, it's good. Yeah. It's really good. Absolutely. Sticky mango rice ice cream. All right, try it out. It's really good. It's coconutty. It tastes like sticky rice. You don't like it? She hates it. Absolutely. It's really good. <laughs> Do you just hate coconut? Jumbo vegan hot dog coming up. <laughs> Thank you. I have been craving a hot dog for like three months. Is this from Vicious Dogs, based here in uh, North Hollywood, actually? Oh, really? As local as local can get to here. Ah, uh, first hot dog bite in three months. Are you satisfied? No. Is it nowhere near? Oh, no. What's it look like on the inside? What's it look like? It looks like a hot dog. Uh, I'm not gonna say that it's bad because I feel like if I went to the restaurant and I had it there, but it tastes like it was burnt and then it was sat out for a while before they put it in my bun. We're gonna try a vegan dog. It doesn't have the same, like when you bite into it, it doesn't give you that same like texture anything. It's like a- You know when you bite into a hot dog and it has that like, it's almost like a 7-Eleven hot dog That's with, a diff cool. with a different flavor. Yeah. Exactly. There's no like I sat here going this, like. This is garbage. All right, fried pickles. Is a Cajun fried pickle? Oh, so it's got a little kick to it. Mm -hmm. It's got a little extra something. Mm, that's good. I just carry guac around. The pickle tastes weird, but the crispy, the batter is amazing. I like it. Yeah. yeah, is it good? It kind of yeah. tastes a lot like guac though. What? No. That looks edible. I think someone went, is I don't like root? this. Is, is it it, lo it looks like it's been sitting there for a minute. Let's wow. try it. Let's try it. I will totally take a bite if you take a bite. Go like that. See, now, there now you it's go. good. There now you go. it's good. Get it. Okay. There. No, not. Okay. Yeah. Trash, not. <laughs> <laughs> Trash, <right? laughs> Trash cream. <laughs> Okay. Wait, I mean, if she did it, I thought you were present. <laughs> trash cream. Hashtag trash, trash cream. Oh, sub zero. Well done. That is trash cream. We ate trash cream. So we totally ate ice cream out of a trash can. That's something that happened. I mean, I guess when it comes down to it, I've eaten worse, right? Right. Yeah. It's pretty cool looking. It's beautiful. Whoa. Fucking good. Yeah, is it? Good. We're just gonna take a full on bite here. Yay. That's 100% the best thing here. It just tastes like real sushi. It really oh, just tastes yay. like sushi. It's really, really, really good. Like I told you guys earlier, there are DJs and live entertainment here going on behind us. The place has filled out a lot. 4.15 in the afternoon. So the place has been going on for about five hours now. I can't give you a review because it's a fucking rave. Yeah. I'm at the festival, guys. They sold out. Two people after us. Wow. I want to try it. What kind of cheese is this? Holy shit. It's not cheese. What? Why is that so good? I told you I waited for my mac and cheese for this place. It's not mac, it's like pesto. Yeah. yeah. It's so 
Wow. What is wow. that? Oil-y that, feeling that like... That is so goddamn good. Sorry, tuna burrito. Yeah. Wow. There's a new shirt oh. in town. Oh. <laughs> That's so good. I did get this wonderful like vegan maple right. sprinkled donut. I'm gonna go for this one. Compared to a classic like maple sprinkled donut, that's fucking great. Oh yeah, this one's good too. You Matt, to Chris, and I just tried the donutery at the Coffee and Donut Festival. Two of the vegan street fair. It is. <laughs> you almost walked right into that. It is day two of the vegan street fair. We are just checking out of our hotel room. quite lunch brunch was really good we got a uh, soy riso breakfast tacos and uh, some breakfast potatoes enjoyed that it had a little cocktail everything's just getting started up here at the vegan street fair let's go find some food Just grabbed vegan pizza. That is what we've been waiting for. You've been craving this. I sure have. Woo! This is what pretty much what drew us back here. Picking up a couple items that we tried. Uh, this this vegan pizza is something excited. That was the tomato basil from Rock and Roll Pizza. Oh, that's yummy. Oh, is it good? It tastes like regular pizza. So. Definitely not as crunchy. Mm -hmm. It's good though. It's good. Flavor-wise, it's it's amazing. I think you could serve someone that slice of pizza, and I don't know if they would have a complaint about it. Well done, rock and roll pizza. It's all pizza, pizza. Woo! Alright. Right. Avocado Mama. Avocado Mama, look at that. Oh, oh yeah. That's their OG Mac. And this is their own special cheese. It's good. They need some salt and pepper. That's no mac and yeast. Yeah, the mac and yeast. The mac and yeast today. was amazing. That was. So. <laughs> Hi guys. Let's talk about the vegan festival here. Good time. Yes. Ton of options. Yes. Lots of things going on. The options are incredibly repetitive. It's just a repetitive, so you have 200 places that are selling roughly five different categories of food. Like almost every single place had a mac and cheese option. 
Yes. And then they have, so they have the $4 bites. You can get like a small bite of something for $4 and everything is the mac and cheese because it's easy to throw in a thing. And or you know. like a single piece of chicken or something like that. Uh, we did stop earlier and grab that pizza. That pizza was five stars. It was different. That was amazing. That pizza There's was really what, good. one or two places here that are doing like a vegan pizza? There's only or, two places I've seen and that was the one I wanted yesterday and then we came back for. Okay, so two places that are actually doing pizza, so they're kind of rare. What else was was different? The sushi burrito. Sushi with the burrito. Jackfruit. You know how I didn't see like I don't see buffalo cauliflower anywhere, and I feel like that's a I don't, not a lot of cauliflower. Sure. They use a lot of cauliflower in replacement. As a base. Yeah. yeah. And it, I haven't seen really any a lot of jackfruit cheesesteak we had yesterday. Yes. And it was like it just had some caramelized onions on it, and I was like, I'm eating. I want to eat veggies. Like, where's the green peppers? Where's the mushrooms? Like, where's None of these places seem to, no to have it. Veg yeah. vegetables. Where are the vegetables? And, like, not talking down, everyone's been incredibly kind. Everyone's been nice. Uh, you have a ton of options of different variations of the same thing. So, it, <laughs> I mean, it's, it's true. true. It's really true. Now, the pricing does go from every place does have a $4 bite, which is kind of like a little $4 sampler of something. Street fair pricing, I guess, makes sense. I feel like the portion size does not match a $4. I would agree. Value it on as what some of the places. Yeah, as some of the places, $4 is a lot. Like a single strip of fake chicken. Being or do they also feel like they're not showcasing their best thing on the four dollar bites? When I feel like you should be showcasing your star Something. to make people want to buy the wanna, actual thing. Yeah, prices seem to go from four dollars all the way up to twenty dollars. The the cheesesteak that we got earlier in this video was a twenty dollar <laughs> cheesesteak. It was so good. No. <laughs> wow. How? How did you think that was good? Really? The liked meat was it. like me. The so bread did was like me. Like to do. So, if you guys are in the North Hollywood, let's say just Southern California area, and you guys want to experiment with some vegan food, definitely come out. Get that Impossible Burger, the Impossible 2.0 Burger. The sushi jackfruit the, burrito. The jackfruit sushi burrito. That was, that was delicious. Really there are quite a few great options here. and wrap up this adventure. We are getting in the car, heading home. Whew. Good time in Hollywood? Yeah. We had a damn good time. Thank you to the Vegan Street Fair for having us out. We enjoyed our time. Thank you to Kevin and Jessica for joining us here on this adventure. We had a good time. I hope they did too. Make sure to click subscribe if you guys have not already because we have more adventures coming up. It's I've been enjoyed real, it. it's been fun. Any last minute And it thoughts? has been real fun. It has been real fun. That's true. All right, guys. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye. That's <laughs> the